Hi Skip, so here we are in the salon, um, back away as much as I can, so here's the floor, uh, and there's a switch right here. But when the rug is removed, it reveals the engine coming in the mirror. And that is the caterpillar. Right down there. Batteries are on either side back there, the shaft. There's uh, two bilge pumps there. One of them is the high water alarm. And we just down it goes. Sitting at the helm. The control. This is Hank's list that he had printed out when he leaves the boat. And this is the Ray Marine unit. There is a smaller one just like it that he has at home. Only smaller, I think it's a 9 inch. Um, Put your view out the front. That boat's pretty close up there. So, now, here we are. There's some chairs for the back deck stored there. Here is the co-pilot chair. There is storage underneath. I don't know what's in there. Not so much. And there's a little, a little puka right in here. And it's got spare keys and stuff. I see there's a remote control in there for... I think the spotlight. And over here is the helm chair, these cushions. That blue is tape. No, we can't tell. Well, anyway, the cushions are brand new last year. And so there's your remote battery switch there. There's your switch for the engine box cover. Your 12 volt house batteries, um, battery switches down there. This was all done by Hodgson, I think. And there are two pukus there. Plenty of storage. storage now. So, your marine unit, your radio, your SIMRAD. The autopilot. So there's a footrest for the co pilot, your books, your charting things. And then over here, these are two berths that are couches. These guys here, where am I? They come right off so, so that your berth is bigger. And then they just hold the, the back of the cushion up. It goes back in under there, and it's six foot four, I think I have measured. It's in the listing. Fans, LEDs, LED lights, LED lights, another fan, light. These are opening windows with screens here. There's a full glass door here, up there, there are your davits, and your davit mounts, there's a cockpit table right there, there's boarding steps, and the steps going to the flybridge. Alright, so here's this berth, this is a full 6 four also open. Here is the cockpit table, but before we look at that, you can see there are 
drawers down there and there are some spare parts there's some tools here there are your ship's papers and some books and other things there's more more stuff and parts for things in those drawers has your US, or the, the safety stuff is right over there. And so this table, you can see, it's hard for me, but it, it has two leaves and they just have little pull out supports under here, I see. Now right there to hold them. And it goes. Full size. My first time playing with it. So this is really on top of here. We're big. It bolts down. It screws down, and these are the screws for it right here to hold it down. That's what it is. Um, I have not seen these cushions, but everything about the boat is very nice. I uh, don't know even what color they are. Uh, I can find out from Hank and get some pictures of that for you. There's a rug here I have not seen. I haven't paid attention to the boat enough, not nearly enough. I see them. I see it mostly in the winter when everything is gone. Um, what else? What else? So here you are. In the salon, it's got a nice headliner in the Harrishoff style, right there. Yeah, wipers, stereo speakers. There's stereo speakers out back in the cockpit. Uh, all of the windshields have windshield washers, pantograph. Uh, so here you are, and so and now we have a cutaway here. Quite roomy, and really, nice, really nice. Feet can holly down there. Sorry about my finger. There is, you go down here. Yeah, heat it going for a little bit to warm my pinkies. There's a track right here where the privacy curtain goes, and it goes against the wall in a couple of like you would do with a curtain. So here we are. And there's storage under all of these. I don't think there's anything in them now. No, there's nothing here. And your chain locker. And this is a real Bomar sea hatch up here. Look at that. Like you'd see on a deep sea sailboat. So here's the stove. It is pulled out. I see that they're working on. Andy has been working. Oh, you can't see it down there, but the propane is disconnected. Storage here. The water filter. It's having a new antifreeze coolant tank. The water pump I see in the mechanic shop, so they're just doing some maintenance to it, probably putting in an impeller. I don't know. And here's the head. Let me just turn on the light. 